As long as Barbarossa's knights were present, peace endured. But the emperor could not be everywhere at once. Whenever he went to Italy, Germany would flare up. And when Barbarossa returned to Germany, the Italians began plotting again. Milan had fallen, but the remainder of the Italian cities joined together in a confederation known as the Lombard League for the purpose of defeating Barbarossa. If Barbarossa intended to make Italy part of the Holy Roman Empire, he would have to conquer the Lombard League city by city. But Barbarossa still had a secret weapon. Henry the Lion and his seasoned troops. Our fort is under attack by the Lombards. I will send my knights to assist you, though I fear they will be too late. Sir Stormer. Now we will be forced to rebuild our forces before we can conquer Italy. Ouvert, ouvert, ouvert. 
ouvert. Ouvert.
Spacebar. Hey, sir. <laughs> 
Geräte. Uwere. Realize the might of the Holy Roman Emperor. 
Henry the Lion was immediately banished to England. Separated from his wealth and army, there was little more he could do to plague Barbarossa. After six campaigns down to Italy, Barbarossa was weary of crossing the Alps. The fighting ended with the signing of the Treaty of Constance, which said effectively that the Emperor and the Pope were equals. It was a tenuous peace, and one that seemed unlikely to endure, when suddenly the Pope died. The new pope was less interested in squabbling with the emperor than he was in events down south. You see, the Europeans were being driven out of the Holy Land. It was time for another crusade. 